Denise Miller. I own and operate Sundog Express Dog Sled Tours. We take people for dog sled rides, we teach people to mush dogs, and we raise dogs. I was born and raised in Fairbanks, Alaska. This is my lead dog, Dudley. He is an Alaskan Husky. And Dudley and I would like to say, welcome to Musher Chick. Right? Yeah. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. Sled dogs make it look so easy to dress for the Alaska cold. The ability to deal with the cold of the Arctic comes naturally to them. After all, they were born with it. Humans, on the other hand, may have a few challenges when the temperatures in Alaska can reach lows of minus 60 degrees Fahrenheit on midwinter days. Running a team of sled dogs can be one of the coldest sports you'll try while visiting Alaska. Not only must you deal with the air temperature, but because the sled is in constant motion, you must also deal with a wind chill, making your ride behind a dog team even colder than the surrounding air temperature. How should you dress for such an endeavor? Alaskans always say, dress for warmth, not to impress. Cold hands and feet are never any fun. Warm layers are a must. First, start with a layer of clothing that has moisture wicking properties. This layer is better known as long johns or long underwear that move body moisture away from the skin, thus preventing the escape of heat. Next is the insulative layer. This layer may be adjusted to how warm it is outside. Still cold? Add another layer. Last is the windproof layer. This prevents the wind from moving through your under layers and reducing the heat. Make sure your boots fit well and aren't too snug. Layer wool or synthetic socks for warm toes. <laughs> may be layered as well. Start with a synthetic liner glove, cover with an insulative glove, then have big over mitts to put over them all if needed. If you are taking a dog sled school, having gloves that you can easily work snaps and grab collar rings with is a must. Bulky gloves usually don't work too well. Finally, don't be shy about using chemical hand, foot, and body warmers. They are a little slice of heaven out on the dog sled trail. Many dog sled tour companies do have gear to lend or rent if you've overlooked an item or two. Dressing for the weather doesn't have to be intimidating, but can be a lot of fun. This has been Elise and Dudley for Musher Chick. Happy trails! <laughs> Yeah.